What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? When you were eight and you had bad traits, you go to school and learn the golden rule. So why are you acting like a bloody fool? If you get hot, then you must get cool. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? Oh, what you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? Oh, what you gonna do when they come for you? You chuck it on that one. You chuck it on this one. You chuck it on your mother and you chuck it on your father. You chuck it on your brother and you chuck it on your sister. You chuck it on that one and you chuck it on me. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for Let me you? Out. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys. What you? What's going on, Southline? It's Aiden. And I'm Annabelle, and we're back with your Wednesday news. Attention all seniors. Senior video needs baby photos from every senior by Thanksgiving break, November 22nd. Baby photos should be between the ages of 0 and 3. Submit your photos to this link below or to the senior video Instagram. Here's a flyer with more information. Hey Annabelle, isn't it crazy that Thanksgiving is a little over a week away? Yeah, I'm so excited. That means Christmas is coming up soon. Let's send it to a fun Thanksgiving interview to get in the spirit. Hello, I'm here with... Uh, my name is Carter Ponsock. And Carter, what is your favorite Thanksgiving tradition? My favorite Thanksgiving tradition has to just be having a Thanksgiving dinner on Thanksgiving Day. Yeah, that's cool. What's your favorite food? I would have to say my favorite food about Thanksgiving is a chocolate pie. Same. Hello, I'm here with... Aiden Miller. And Aiden, what is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Cheesy mashed potatoes. That's a great choice. I don't mind them myself. And Drew, Drew what's your favorite Thanksgiving tradition? Watching the, watching the lines, but yeah, it's, that's a common choice these days. Yeah. Hello, I'm here with Brendan Hall. And Brendan, what is your favorite Thanksgiving tradition? Going to my grandma's house. Yeah, what do you do at your grandma's? Watch football and then eat Thanksgiving dinner. Are you excited to watch the Lions play this year? Oh uh, yeah, I can win. Hello, I'm here with Christian Hay. And Christian, what is your favorite Thanksgiving tradition? Uh, I definitely got to say the uh, family football games. Those are always fun. Yeah, what's your favorite football team? Uh, got to go with the Lions, even though we suck. Thank you, Christian. Thanks for joining me, SL. Peace out. I can't believe it was snowing yesterday. Right? It's been getting a lot colder recently, and I'm not ready for this winter weather to come. Let's send it to Adam to see if we'll be seeing any more snow coming our way. What's up, SL? It's Adam with the weather. Today, it's cloudy with a low of 31 and a high of 37. Before we take a look at our seven-day forecast, I have a joke for you. What do you call a bear with no teeth? Now, let's check out that forecast. So what do you call a bear with no teeth? A gummy bear. <laughs> Now, let's take it back to our lovely anchors. Don't forget that Washtenaw CC is coming to South Line on December 6th during all lunches in the Commons, so be sure to check in with them to get more information. And also don't forget, the Freshman Student Council is hosting a dine-in to donate tomorrow at Aubrey's. Stop by at all lunches to grab a flyer and buy it to show up at dinner. A portion of the proceeds will go to Freshman Student Council for future events. SLC3 will be selling cookies and cake after school in the Commons on Tuesday, November 29th. These are being made by one of our very own SLHS students using a recipe that has been passed down by several generations of bakers, so make sure to get some. In other club news, let's send it to a video to learn about South Lions' very own ASL club that meets every Wednesday after school in Miss Koppel's room, B153. Hello, my name is Carter, and I am the student leader of ASL Club. ASL Club is American Sign Language Club, and we aim to teach sign language to students in South Lyon and or teachers in South Lyon. Um, you can join American Sign Language Club 
by showing up to Miss Koppel's room B 153 on Wednesdays after school for one hour. Um, during meetings, we aim to teach American Sign Language. We learn the alphabets and basic sign language to communicate in various ways to one another. This is Aiden. He is a member of the ASL club. He is using sign language as his primary form of communication, and this will help him with his socialization and making friends. There are so many winter sport tryouts happening soon, so let's send it to Lila to find out when they are. Hey SO, it's Lila back with the sports. Speaking of tryouts, boys basketball tryouts will take place November 21st through the 23rd. The freshman tryouts on Monday and Tuesday from 3 to 5 p.m. and on Wednesday from 9 to 11 a.m. JV and varsity tryouts will take place Monday and Tuesday from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. and on Wednesday from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Let's check out a QR code for those who need some more information. Bowling tryouts took place yesterday. Congrats to everyone who made the team. The first bowling match will take place December 9th against Wild Lake Western. In regards to baseball, there will be a player info meeting today in the comments and lecture hall at 2.30. This is for sophomores and up. In preparation for winter, the ski team will be having dry land training at 7 o'clock today. Meet in the batting cages. In other news, hockey is up and running after a great win last week. Great job, boys. This Saturday, the boys will take on Romeo High School at 6 o'clock p.m. It's meet the team night, so make sure to show up and cheer on the team. Good luck, boys. Well, Southline, that's all I have for the sports. Let's send it back to our lovely anchors. Thanks, Lila. Before we go, we'd like to start a new segment to feature some individual students. We will end today's broadcast with our first student spotlight. Bye, SL. We'll see you again Friday. On this week's student spotlight, I'm here with Sincere. Hello. How's it going? I'm good. How are you? Great. I'm so good. I heard you're a big fan of TV. I am. That's good to hear. That's why we're going to have you on this week. Uh, I really love Broadway. Uh, I, love, uh, I, I love like uh, what song? What song? Uh, I like Girl of My Dreams. Uh, it's it's really good. Like I listen to it every time, like every day. That's like your like, go-to song. Yes, it is. Music like calms me down, mm -hmm. get me into like a good mood. Cause like when I'm like feeling mad or, or, or I'm about to flip out, mm -hmm. uh, I just like go in the room, get on my phone, and like um, listen to music. Cause it calms me down. Then uh, when it calms me down, yes, I love to read. Uh, but read, read, reading like gets my mind back into focus. Cause like when when I'm like feeling sidetracked or feeling or feeling like like I'm about to like do something wrong, you know, I just like pick up a book, and, like you know, keep reading, cause because like books are interesting and it has everything uh, you could ever want in the book. Uh, all I have to say is follow your dreams and your goals. Don't let nobody stop you for what you do. And let the haters hate. They're going to hate all your life. Uh, see me, I, I, I'm going to get past me uh, because I'm not about to let the uh, haters stop my dreams and goals. Uh, and, do, and don't let nobody tell you different. But so I have a question for everybody. Well, what does the banana do when it's scared? It peels off. Thanks for coming, Sincere. Bye. We appreciate it. Bye. We'll see you next time. Bye.